Hi, today I'm going to show you all about safe cutting. To cut safely, you'll need a sharp knife. I'll show you how to sharpen your knife and I'll show you how you can cut safely using a bridge hold and a claw grip. Okay, to cut safely you need a sharp knife to make sure it's sharp. Get yourself a nice knife sharpener. Your knife can be cheap, that's fine. As long as you've got a knife sharpener, fix it to your work surface. Just drag it through three times, should be enough unless it's really damaged. And you've got a nice sharp knife. Unclip it, pop that out of the way. These are only about six pounds. Next, I'm going to show you the bridge hole. Hold the knife in your writing hand, the hand where you'd hold a pen or a pencil. With the other hand, I want you to make a bridge. That bridge is going to hold whatever you want to cut onto the board. So round things roll around, use your bridge to hold it. The knife goes under the bridge. Here we go. If it's got a flat side, put it on its flat side. The knife goes under the bridge. You use your bridge hold, but make sure your knife goes under the bridge. If you cut this way, you could cut your fingers. This way, the knife doesn't really go near your fingers. Always keep your eyes on what you're doing. That's the bridge hold. Next, the claw grip. Again, hold your knife in your strong hand, your writing hand. This time, you're going to use a claw to hold whatever you're cutting and your nails will act as armor, will shield your fingers so the knife can get really close. This is the technique that top chefs use. Right up to your nails, move your nails back, cut again, nails back, cut again, nails back, cut again. Your nails will protect you from the sharpness of the blade. You'll notice chefs on TV doing that really quickly and not looking at what they're doing. I suggest you look at what you're doing. Bridge, claw. Safe cutting. So for more really easy, delicious recipes and step-by-step -step guidance, take a look at my website, www.fresherbites.co.uk. You can get my booklet there for 4 99 plus postage with all the easy recipes in it. Or better still, why not get a download of the booklet that you can use on your phone? You can use the ingredients list as a shopping list while you're out shopping. And also, for a 4 99 a year subscription, you can get access to a film of every recipe that's in the book, and every two weeks there'll be another new recipe. Pop over to Facebook, tell me what you'd like to see me cooking. Show me what you've been cooking, ask me some questions. It'd be lovely to see you. See you soon.